Good, Good morning. morning! We're going to show you how to make coffee at home today. All right, let's get into it. Mama, it is a lovely day today. It is a lovely day. It's a lovely rainy day. No, it's rainy. Rainy days are not lovely. They're not. Mm -mm. Look at that hair though. Yeah, good morning. Corpus Christi, Texas. Coming to life in the rain. Okay, so let's get into making the coffee. This is a brewed batch of overnight coffee in the cute little container I got at Home Goods. I'm currently using the Dunkin' Donuts cold brew. I love the Walmart version as well. Um, really, they all kind of perform the same these big packs and you just steep them in a pitcher of water overnight and it makes a concentrate. I use almond milk. I'm just not a cow's milk fan, personal preference. And then I love the salted caramel syrup from Tarani. I also get it at Home Goods for like six or seven bucks. You can order them on Amazon as well. So 90 calories for a cup of this, 100 calories for two tablespoons of the coffee. We're going to pull out the pods and discard them. And here's my concentrate. You can add water to this. I don't. I leave it full blend. And then I just add a little bit of almond milk to thin it out slightly, but I like mine really nice and strong like you would find at a Starbucks. So I got this cute cup at Walmart for about five bucks. I've got a bunch of different colors of them and I love them. I've just added some ice to it and I'm going to pour my cold brew concentrate over the ice. Depending on how much coffee I want, sometimes I'll make half a cup, sometimes I'll fill it all the way up. You know, you judge. You do you. I'm going to do my almond milk. I don't like too much milk in mine, so I do about a quarter of a cup, maybe a little less than that. But of course, make it to your personal preference. I typically don't measure. I pour a, about a tablespoon every morning, but I'm going to go ahead and measure for the sake of the calorie content here. Ooh, yummy. Pour that delicious syrup in. And we're going to stir it up a little bit. And that is it. That is a delicious, wonderful cold brewed coffee that would fool anybody that it's not from a coffee house. Mm. I am telling you, this is just as good, if not better, than a Starbucks coffee for a fraction of the price and the calories. Okay, we're currently in my bed enjoying our coffee and I wanted to show y'all what I used to order. Okay, I would get an iced coffee with milk. Gotta trade it up to a venti. Oh my gosh, what is this, a Trenta? That is new. So I would go with my venti. I would take my six shots of classic sweetener take it down to three and then add two pumps of caramel sauce because we've got to have a caramel and then I would change milk to almond milk just because I don't drink regular milk personal choice Zoe does no shade there just my own thing and it would come out to 170 calories okay so here's a nutrition facts on what I would have then we add to our order and let's see how much it would cost me. <clears throat> okay, so my iced coffee with milk, venti, with two pumps of caramel and three pumps of classic syrup would come out to a total of $5.14 and 170 calories, right? So, welcome to my phone. My background matches my case. Pretty cool, huh? All right, all right. Don't get too snoopy here. So, we go into my 90 calories of almond milk for a cup, but I only used about a quarter of a cup, maybe less than that. 
And then I had my one tablespoon of caramel syrup. Remember, it's 100 calories for two tablespoons. <clears throat> There's no calories for the coffee. So we're looking at 80 calories, 75 calories, uh, give or take, depending on how much almond milk and how much sweetener you use. So that's it. That's how I make my lazy everyday coffee. Um, it's so delicious. It is so easy. Sometimes I do it iced. Sometimes I do it hot. Just depends on what mood I'm in. Uh, but I always do it looking like this. <sighs> Thank you all for watching. Check out some of my other videos. And I have some really cool DIY stuff coming at you this week. See you later. What do you say? Bye-bye.